we are just uh, going to do a code build demo so it is just a simple and very easy topic from AWS so I'm just uh, doing that lab which I have taken from the AWS and it is it will be based on Java so it is just a simple lab because from AWS uh, document it was giving some error so I thought it will be better to resolve those error and I uh, will host uh, show that lab so first of all uh, what is AWS code build we can just quickly see what is it what it is so AWS code build is fully managed build service in the cloud so code build what it will do it will compile your source code and runs unit test and produces the artifacts that we are going to see how it will do and uh, it provide prepackaged build environment for popular languages like Apache Maven and like programming languages Java other languages and uh, we can use tools build tools like Apache Maven Gradle and more so and uh, so basically this is fully man uh, provide the benefits of fully managed on demand out of box so in detail you can uh, read on the website itself and uh, so this is how it used to work so this is your source code suppose you have checked in so then it will be uh, build that project and whatever uh, uh, like artifacts you can take from the like input source code you can host from the github or any other repo and then you can host your project on code build and then you can see uh, like uh, logs and everything here in uh, Amazon like CloudWatch and there so let's now quickly come to the demo you can take this uh, demo from here also getting started with console so there is a project given there so like create the source code so basically this is the source code which I am using here simply this will be the basic structure so let me show you my okay so this is our source in source this is a main folder this is a Java folder and this is the message util file which is a Java based file which I had given here and this is a test folder then ja this test message util file is there now then you need to create a build spec file and then you have to uh, give a uh, form file also for apache maven so let me uh, give you so basically in code build uh, the main file is build spec so what it does it will define the uh, stages like uh, suppose if you have uh, created ci cd pipeline and uh, in those pipeline you have some yaml file so in gitlab gitlab dot uh, yaml file circles i also there is a yaml file so basically these files will define the stages like here somewhere they define it as a job somewhere they define it as a stages here it has defined as faces so first what it will do it will install a runtime version of Java and that is 17 I have taken because for uh, here if you will see in the code so okay first uh, let me show you what they had done so this is the root directory here so in root directory I have shown you that source folder you need to create then main Java and then you have to uh, create some if you want to test only for that purpose you can just create this uh, Java file that I have already created so this is the Java file and another thing is this uh, test message util.java file that is also I have created this is the file so you just follow those steps so in case of error you can see my video so this is the file and then there is a pom file you need to give and it will be having 3.8.0 version there upper maven compiler that you can uh, take so that all these you need to do then there is a file build spec file so this file will define the stages like first install stages and if you want to learn more about so there will be a uh, like build spec syntax and everything will be given in like uh, here reference will be given so you can learn from there but we need to uh, this is the mandatory file which we need to create here in your project also that file you need to create 
and then you can define uh, like uh, what Java version you are installing that it is installing 11 but we don't need to do because it will give you error so I have taken 17 version here and uh, another thing is uh, like pre-build nothing to do so simply we are defining the build here so build will do the M MVN install so like compile build everything it will do and then in artifacts it will uh, be defining this location but we are not defining this location because it will give some error if you will try to do this so you just need to change that and you can take this location so it will include all the file otherwise it may you may get some error so it's up to you how you have to do that so these after creating this structure you just need to go to the this second step uh, create s3 to s3 bucket so okay so this is my bucket and first is input bucket so in this input bucket this message util dot zip folder you need to upload so suppose uh, this all you have to do is this folder this spec and this and you need to compress to zip file and then it you need to give it to name message util whatever you want to give but you have to uh, give that name in reference also now after uploading this so bucket first you need to create the buckets in bucket you need to upload this uh, message util dot zip file here that's it and there are two buckets you need to uh, create first is for input source second is for output that you need to do then you need to come to the like uh, this is just uh, I have just finished this so let me show you duplicate that so like uh, here you will get uh, create build project so you can give any name here and then this is a source you need to provide like uh, from bitbucket github so these are the uh, on, online source from where you can take your code I am taking it from Amazon S3 so I have given this Amazon S3 and this is my input bucket which I had given then this folder I need to upload here and then I have choose manage image Amazon Linux 2 so that it will uh, refer and then environment I have uh, chosen standard so for this image so those you need to specify according to your environment or your needs so basically this programming language runtimes are now included in the standard image of Ubuntu 18.04 recommended for new code build get in the C docker image provided by the code build so you can check this so these are the standard environment then you have to uh, define like uh, you can give build command also or you can just define a spec file so use a build spec file so I have uh, already defined those commands so I have just used this file otherwise you need to give the command here then artifacts so basically where you need want to uh, create your artifacts so those will be uh, like another bucket that is the output bucket which I have created so suppose uh, this is my output bucket and uh, these will be the artifacts like uh, this it has created after build so earlier it was not there so that's how you need to uh, define two buckets and those paths so that you have to define there then cloud watch and other option you can do and then your project will be created so that project I have created here so okay. see this is the project which will be created and then once you have created then you can integrate it with your uh, other part and then once you will click on start build it will create your build so and then you can see the logs how it is happening so like this is my earlier build which I had run earlier and you can see the entire logs here so it was failed earlier so those error I have resolved now so you just 
uh, need to do some basic changes there in your code and it will uh, run smoothly and then what it will do it will create your artifacts here this will be the artifact so basically whatever your code uh, like if you are from devops you will be knowing about like first uh, you have to package so your package will be ready and from here you can use these to deploy on the server wherever you want to do that so this is the basic of uh, aws code build and these are the steps which here are given so you can just uh, search on getting started input bucket console or i will provide the links in description and uh, these steps you need to follow this like upload source file and uh, this is the location and then this one create the build project that is the start build then run build and once it will be done so it will show you the errors and everything which is there running command and detail so similar to gitlab or jenkins you can easily basically in aws it will be very easy to create your build and see artifacts succeeded so then it will create your output uh, artifacts in output folder so here in this so this is the latest version so 135 and at that time it has created so this uh, it will create so that's how you can similar to uh, other circle ci if you have done or any gitlab or uh, github you have used so similar to that uh, if you want to create artifacts through code build you can easily do that so that's all from my side all you need to take care is this uh, build spec.yml file i have already told you that 17 you have to define or this uh, files location that path you need to uh, give that so that it can include all the files because i had given that path but it was i was some getting error so i have what i have done i have just put the all so it will include it it will include all the files so i think that's it from my side thanks for watching